Well, there you see it. Can you play that guitar, Donny J? My daddy used to pick them up, or did he? He used to hum a bit, sit down at the organ or the piano, and play the accordion too. His name was Reverend Harry B. Gibbons. Imagine that. He had a wife, my mama, Ella Gibbons, same as my son-in-law, Jerry Barbie, at that time. His mama's name was Ella, too. Now he's on the way to Florida, and I'm a long ways from through. He's part of my board of directors on mymissionhomestead.com, mymission.homestead.com, pull it up. This was my office and living quarters for three years. God says, sell it, Donnie, and we're moving on. So now I'm in a motor home, moving on. I have a bit, few things here left. But they're going to be going soon. I was going to talk about the attorney, but I'm not going to do that. He says I, well I, well he said somebody, he wasn't sure he trusted me. Well, I'll tell you, Lord. <laughs> Vengeance is mine, says the Father God. That's not a threat, that's a fact. I've seen it happen more. Not once or twice, but that is a fact. So walk and trust in Jesus. You go to by above, yes. The only way above is through Jesus Christ, God's plan. You might have other gods, and you may not. But if you got the Father God and talk to him through Jesus only, as the only way to God. Be born again in the spirit of he, and be proud to be an American. I was going to bring Obama up, but I'm going to pass that by. I pray for him now and then, and I say, not amen, but let's look for the light called Jesus Christ and the plan of the Father God and learn to try with God. There's the clothes I'm hitting the road with and a couple boxes, and there's the old uniform I served in Korea with my two brothers. They called it the Korean Conflict. And there's my umbrella. Thank you, Bob. And Doug. And you too, Adam. It was in his office. You all know my friend Bob. He's gone. I know where. And I care. Any of you other folks wonder about how and where to go? Go to your knees and be born again. And that's on the road very soon. Born Again Ministries. Pray for us. We'll sit in the Walmart parking lots in what city? Starting with Payson, Arizona. I need a driver. If you're qualified, talking about qualifications. Believe me, being a Christian, he qualifies you. And then you become what he has in mind for you to do. Thank you again for calling me in to serve for the U.S. government. I don't have much there that needs moving, but I'm a-going and I want to thank Michelle and her four crew that came and helped me clean this place up today. And my hat's off to a lady. You will get to know her well. Her name is Sue. And I don't mean Sue City Sue. And thank you, Sam Scaff and family. I'll be to you too. And my board of directors, believe me, we're going to have a meeting. And Assembly of God Ministry with you, Motorhomes on the Road, Jerry, I'm not your member, but I am. That's who I am in the spirit of the Father God. Known now as Donnie G. Born Again Ministries, I ask you to pray for the ministries. And keep me in mind, too. He's taken me out of a mercy home since 1903, 2003, sorry about that. I stutter a bit. I had to have my teeth checked over. But in saying that, folks, he's trimmed me up, he's trimmed me down. I use a doctor's remedy, it's called Minerals and Vitamins. Longevity. And you can get them if you use them. The results are there. 
Health Center on Wheels, Assembly of God Ministry, I present it to you. I now, I bow my hand and say to all you churches and charities, get together and pray for the love and compassion of Jesus Christ to come up over this world, including the country of Israel, and let us all seek more peace and more love. I love you all. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Ghost, I love my Father God the most. I say now, Amen. Again, tomorrow, the Lord willing, is another day. And believe me, mothers, I pray for you to raise your children today. And look to Jesus and get married and raise a family in a godly manner, starting in the schoolroom. At home begins in you. Amen. I'm through.